Hey, hey, hey guys. Happy Sunday. Hope everyone is doing well. Let me share. Hope everyone's doing amazing. So today, um, this day six, yes, day six. So weird, it feels like it's already mid-December. Don't the months seem like they're just going by so fast? This year just went ultra fast, so pretty crazy. But tonight I'm gonna be sharing about um, one of our top two foundations that are always selling and that everyone is always getting, which is our CC cream. And I'll explain each one of them. So it's a CC cream and our BB cream. Ah, it's like really bright, huh? And our BB cream. So very, very awesome foundations that I love. This one's almost done. Like I love CC cream. And then I'm gonna be talking about Zen Mascara. So I'm going to do my makeup while we're talking. I actually did not do my makeup today. I've been home um, just chilling with my family, getting stuff done, getting ready for the um, week. Uh, I prime, as always, with any foundations that I have. Um, and this is a primer I shared on day one. It's going to minimize my pores and just make sure that my makeup goes on nicely. You do not have to use primer, but I love it because it makes the makeup stay on longer. I tend to have a lot of like large pores, so I like those to be minimized. Um, and I'm gonna be using CC Cream tonight because it's my favorite. So CC Cream is, uh, the CC stands for Color Corrector. Um, this is a light to medium coverage, so this is not a full coverage at all, um, but it's awesome because it's going to color correct uh, any skin imperfections. Um, for example, I have a lot of redness, maybe some uh, unbalanced skin tone, so it's going to definitely do that. Uh, this is uh, $16.90. Uh, per tube of CC cream. Uh, so it's going to color correct. It's going to cover skin imperfections. It's going to give you that color balance uh, and skin tone. And it's also skincare in one. It does have multi minerals in it. Uh, it does have SPF in it. Um, and it's a semi matte. So it's not like a super matte um, foundation. But it goes on really, really nice. This one is light to medium. So I'm going to go ahead and put it on. Um, so I really love it um, because it really does the job to just color correct and make sure that I have an even um, skin tone on my way out. I wear it a lot for work and just during the week. So CC cream is where it's at for me. So just kind of put it right on my skin and just put it on there. How's everybody's weekend going? Have you guys been doing some Christmas shopping? I am about to start this week, but I'm really grateful because I thought I was going to start later in the week um, because I was just waiting, you know, for payday and pharmacy payday and everything. So everything came in. So I'm really excited about that. Let's see here. So I'm just using a, a blender um, sponge or beauty blender. As you can see, my face is already just radiant, glowing. Um, you see that the redness uh, went away and all of my skin is one even skin tone. So this is color correcting CC cream. And you can use this as a base. So some people like to do the color correcting foundation first and then they put their full coverage uh, foundation on top. So you can definitely do that if you want to. I've done it before, like for pictures and stuff, like family photos and stuff. I do this and then I put my VFX uh, foundation, which I went over VFX. Did you guys see the photos after? Like it, honestly, I love the VFX because I don't really have to use filters. It looks really beautiful and lighting and I take really good pictures with that. I don't say I take really good pictures, but you know. So that's that. Very simple, I like literally put it on way faster than this in the morning before I go to work. So it's a very good, um, fast, like just pick me up type of foundation. So I really, really love it. 
So after this, I'm gonna go really simple tonight. So this is the CC cream. Now we do have BB cream. I can probably put that on another night, but BB cream doesn't have color correcting. It's more of a moisturizing uh, foundation. So it's called a beauty, uh, I think they call it, the BB stands for beauty balm. Um, so it's just going to just give you that radiant glow, very light, minimal coverage. Um, so I do wear it like on days that I just want really light, you know, makeup. It's really good for you. You can use it under your um, regular foundations as like a moisturizing base. Um, so this is a good uh, foundation as well. Very light foundation. I'd say this is more like a tinted foundation in my opinion, but um, I think CC cream gives a lot, a little bit more coverage if you're looking for that or you're looking more for like uh, perfecting any type of impurities on your face or you're wanting even any, like even skin tones and whatnot, then I would go with CC cream. So I don't know. That's my jam. I love CC cream. So next, um, I'm just going to do use the three in one face palette. It's $18 and 90 cents bronzer, highlighter and blush. So I'm just going to do a simple look this evening. So the BB cream, that one is $15.90 if you're interested in that as well. How's everyone doing? Thank you for joining. Just doing a quick makeup. Some days I'm just like, let's go. And usually my go-to items are is what I'm actually wearing, gonna wear tonight for you guys. So that was my CC cream, I primed. CC cream and then I'm going with my three-in-one palette. So I'm getting some color and life into my face. And then I do a little bit of blush. And I'm gonna use this uh, as my eyeshadow tonight too. So I really like this three-in-one face palette because you can use it for your face and you can use it for your eyes if you want to. So that's that's it. Getting a nice little glow. Uh, CC cream's not gonna cover up all of your like freckles or anything like that if you're looking for that, which I don't mind showing off my freckles. I just like a glow and just some even skin tone and no big redness on my face. So I don't have a problem with my freckles at all. Uh, I'm not even gonna put anything on my eyebrows tonight. Some, some days I don't really put anything on my eyebrows. It just depends on what's happening. I do put a little color. If I do, I do um, the mono uh, eyebrow powder. So that's what I do. So for the eyes, I'm just gonna go, so I'm gonna put a little highlighter on top to do like the little light color. So this is like my fast, to go to so if you want to buy this bundle let me know because it is really fast especially for busy busy mamas and women and anybody that just needs a fast makeup routine and now I'm going in with bronzer and this is my favorite bl uh, brush from pharmacy whoops I put bronzer like right here I need to take it off but um I love this it has a double end uh, it's called brush <laughs> can't talk so that's all I'm doing and then I'll put just a little bit of pink sometimes in there not too much but it's just a very natural very simple look so I love this I use it all the time uh, all over my face literally and then sometimes if I want to blend it in just a little bit more I'll go in with like a little bra like brush and just kind of like just blend it out a little bit and I pull some of that powder under my eye line here okay so there's that and then I am um, showing you guys today is the Zen mascara this is our $8.90 mascara and it's amazing. This is one of the first mascaras that I used when I started using pharmacy um, makeup. It's amazing. Um, if you're looking for lengthening, this is the mascara for you. It's called Extension Lash Mascara. So it's Zen. It's really nice. I love it. Um, oh yeah. I always do this first before I put on my um, mascara. I'm having trouble saying what each item is. 
I was gonna say eyebrows, but I'm not putting them on my eyebrows. So all of this one you'll see has the brush, the little brushes. Uh, there's longer, uh, like longer ends and then shorter ends. It's really good. Like you build, it, it's very buildable. Really love this mascara. I've had it for a while too. Uh, all the products are gluten free. They're clean. European standard ingredient products just means they're cleaner than the beauty products here in the US. And that just all comes down to ingredients. You know, some of the stuff we put into our skin and our body might not always be that great. So, of course, we're probably not perfect having every single thing that we use clean, but it's always good to try our best to get cleaner and better quality products for ourselves. Because we want to take care of ourselves, right? And it's always nice when you can do it on a, good, on a budget and that the price point is good. And that's what I liked about pharmacy. Got a mirror here. It's hard getting makeup on a, a phone. Okay, just on the bottom a little bit. But I love our mascaras. We have so many of them. Anyone have any big things going on this week? I would love to hear. Okay, I think I'm done with this. You can put as little or as much as you want. There we go. In a little bit, I will go ahead and do this one more time. So last, usually I put a matte liquid lipstick on or lip gloss. So tonight I'm going to do lip gloss. I'm going to go ahead and share a little bit more about our nude uh, lip glosses. So these are it right here. I love them. This one is Chick Stiletto and this one is Nude Flirt. They're both amazing. Uh, we have other, um, I think we have six total different uh, nude lippies. So we have something for everyone. So tonight I'm gonna go ahead and do a uh, Chick Stiletto. These are the top two that have been sold too. They're very popular, Nude Flirt and Chick Stiletto. They're $16.90. What I love about this uh, lip gloss is that it has shea butter in it, so it moisturizes your lips. So I'm, I really am been reaching for this more often because especially with the weather changing and it getting cold, I've been wanting more moisture on my lips, so I've been using a lot of more lip gloss. Since I wear a mask, I tend to wear the matte lipsticks just because it's not gonna transfer um, very much at all to my mask. If I wear lip glosses and such, th those will kind of transfer on the mask, so it kind of sucks. Um, but really, I wear makeup for, it just proves all of us women, we're wearing masks, but we still wear our makeup uh, because we're doing it for ourselves, right? We wanna wear our makeup and look good um but the biggest thing has been just keeping my lips more moisturized and finding things that are not really going to transfer as much um but i do love this lip gloss i know that once we can go back to normal life in the near future hopefully um i will definitely be rocking lots of lip glosses um so i love lip gloss and i also like that this formula is not very sticky at all like it goes on really smooth feels good on your lips very lightweight and you feel like your lips are just moisturized all day so this is chick stiletto i love this and my lips feel so good the moment i put it on it just looks amazing it just feels amazing it looks amazing too but So there we are. This is my simple look, my everyday simple look. If I'm just, you know, don't wanna do a whole lot of makeup, that's all I use. I really use what, how many products did I use? Used one, two, 
three and four. I used primer too, but that's optional. So these five items are a must have. I love them. So if you do want this same uh, bundle, just let me know. Just say bundle in the comments or just uh, message me and tell me day six bundle and I'll get you um, started. You can also switch up what kind of lipsticks you want, colors, anything like that. But this is like my go-to bundle and I just love it so much. So I hope you guys have an amazing day. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys are loving these little lives. I do have a virtual party, like a winter party with other uh, amazing business women this week. Um, so I will put that up if you want to join in and get a little bit of Christmas shopping done. Uh, I am putting in my last order. I'm putting two orders in this week, Tuesday and then the 13th because... We want to turn everything in before the 14th to ensure that you get all of your products on time. Um, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to invite some of you guys to my virtual winter uh, party. And then I'm also going to put the link if you want to join my closed Facebook page. I'm always posting more information about the products and things that are happening in my team, in the pharmacy world, and just give you information about products that are coming out. So I hope you guys have an amazing night. I hope you guys had an amazing weekend. And I hope you guys have an amazing and blessed week. And I will continue um, seeing you this week. Have a good night.